The TMI show is set to begin. The show is intended for mature audiences, and parental discretion is advised. If you are uptight, socially conservative, or anal retentive, the show is not for you. Good afternoon, people of Earth. How are you? It's the TMI show S3E8 on WSCT. It's September 26th. I'm Justin Berkey here. I and I'm the wild man, Rohawk. Rohawk. How are we today? It's hump day. It's hump day. How are you? Did you? I, yeah, you humping? Yeah, I celebrated hump day early. Cheater. Yesterday. <laughs> yeah, it was a banner day for me, actually. Um, got to celebrate twice yesterday. Ooh. Which, you know, it's, it's always tricky when you don't live with the, the one you love. True. But um, awesome day yesterday. Went to the Botanical Gardens in here in Atlanta with Beth. Did you check that out? Yeah, I saw your pictures. Uh, <laughs> some of them are pretty funny. Have you ever been there? Uh, partially. We went and walked around for a little bit. We were yeah. looking as a, a destination spot. Beautiful day. Beautiful day to do it. And But my one uh, little bit of uh, suggestion, um, do not pee in the fountains. They will throw you out for that stuff. Really? Are they yeah. that uptight? They really are. I mean, th and they hide the bathrooms behind all these vines and trees and stuff. So, I mean, I just had to release. And unfortunately, my, my girlfriend actually got a picture of me. But um, anyway, <laughs> <laughs> we had a great, it's a beautiful place. We saw some lovely orchids. And um, it, was, uh, it was great to go during the week because there wasn't a lot of people there. So we got some great shots and uh, really amazing. I love fall in Atlanta or New York or well, wherever you are. Fall is like, the best. I like the hot dog pictures. They were pretty funny. The hot dog picture? Yeah, the hot dog pictures were funny. <laughs> well, who doesn't like a nice hot dog picture? And Beth Sorry, was, Beth. <laughs> Beth was jealous of eating the, the hot dog. Um, so, yeah, and uh, afterwards, we took a special trip for ribs at Fat Matt's Rib Shack in Atlanta. Famous, famous ribs. These are fall-off-the-bone ribs. They're not a sponsor. I'm just... You know. You're just loving their delicious food. <laughs> and speaking of sponsors, you know, last night I was um, getting my, my second uh, half of Hump Day in, and um, you were trying to reach me. It was important. Oh, my God. You were, like, <laughs> blowing up my phone, and I was in the other room, um, oblivious. <laughs> but um, I really didn't know, but I was guessing that's why you weren't answering. You were, like, cursing me in text, and I'm like, I wasn't even near my phone. <laughs> I was involved in, in um, the ultimate pleasure plateau, as we as we have come to call it. I had and, to share. Uh, as soon as I got out, and uh, yeah, I did hear the call. And we have some great, great irons in the fire as far as sponsors go. Um, it's going to be an exciting year for the TMI show and WSCT. I have a big feeling. Yeah. Now, how about I do give a shout out to the, our Jewish listeners? <laughs> it's Yom Kippur today, and uh, <laughs> Ro, what is so funny? Uh, are you, do you, know, do you, are know, you a Jew? Actually, I'm Jewish. Oh, Jewish. Okay. You're Jewish. I know what it's. I was raised that. I had a bar mitzvah, but nah, mm, mm, not so much. Well, if we're going ham, is it kosher ham? Yeah, we're going <laughs> ham today, and that's <laughs> ham is hard as a mother father. Yes. Um, but seriously, it's not kosher ham. I don't think there's such thing that exists. But um, I wanted to say, what do you know? What Yom Kippur is? I have no idea. You know, see, it's funny. Jews. You know how uh, Christians and Catholics have a confession booth. Mm -hmm. where you go in and you confess your sins, and then you say some stuff, and you're you're, you're good. Jews got it all efficient. It's all in one day. Really? That's what Yom Kippur is. Day of atonement. That's unfair. I know. <laughs> in my faith, we're supposed to go like every, I don't know, as, as often as possible because you screw up all the time. So you're supposed to go confess your <laughs> see, sins. See, the Jews, they put it all into one day so we're not going repeating ourselves. <laughs> we're going to save them all up for one day. And what we do is we, um, we just fast. We don't eat. So we don't eat, we confess our sins for one day, and we're done with it. The problem is, you go into synagogue, you have to wear a gas mask, because everyone has such horrible, horrible breath. It well, stinks in there. You're supposed to fast, right? Fast, fast. And when you fast, what happens? You got you, bad breath, because yeah. your stomach acids are bubbling up, and you can't, uh, you know, you don't want to smell. So Ugh. it's the worst. I've never, I think I've done that twice in my life. How long are you supposed to fast for? It's like a 24-hour deal. Just one day? One day. That's pretty lame. Well, what do you mean? That's for your faith, you can only... Fast for 24 well, hours? It's a day of atonement. It's not the week of atonement. Who do you, how much do you what want is to fast it, what for? What is it for Christians? I think it's like two or three days or something. Really? Like yeah. And the you, only time I would fast if I was uh, got on Survivor or something. Well, it that, makes more sense because you really can't eat anyway. <laughs> yeah, you have to kill what you eat or just if they give you a chicken or something. Killing your co uh, cold this, contestants. This rice is so good. Oh, my God. This rice is wonderful. I'm going to stab you over this palm leaf. <laughs> Well, um, the TMI question of the day, we thought we'd move off of a sexual topic into something that I'm sure everyone has fantasized about. If you won the lottery, 
Ooh. What are the first three things you would spend your money on? What are the first three big expenditures that's you a, would... That's a tough one. That's a good one. That's always... Everyone fantasizes about... I love when people fantasize about winning the lottery and they never play. It's like, you can't <laughs> fantasize if you don't play. No chance of winning. Dollar and um, a dream. <laughs> so if anyone wants to call in, it's 770-257-WSCT. That's 770-257-WSCT. Or for those who can't break it down in, in numbers, it's 770-257-9728. Yes. We would love to hear from you, and we'll put you on. We'll chat a little bit and give us your lottery fantasy. It's always good. I'll take the numbers, too. And say the numbers. We said the numbers. We said the numbers. We got um, numbers. And, um... Wow, you know, I was at I was just at Costco earlier getting one of those hot dogs because it's a cheap lunch. You bought a wiener bomb. I always do. Uh. You no, know, what really weirds me out at that place is like the people that work there, the guys that work in the back. They have you've heard of a hairnet, right? Right. Well, these guys it seems like every guy there that has to have facial hair, they make you wear a beard net. It's to the me, same. It's a hairnet. It's the you're just wearing the hairnet on your face. Really? You're I, supposed to. It's the dumbest looking thing. I think if I had to wear that, I would just shave. Because makes it easier. You wear a big net on your chin. It looks ridiculous. It's fantastic. It's so embarrassing. <laughs> have you had to wear, wear it? No. Oh, okay. You have a beard. <laughs> um, yeah. And uh, yeah. Well, that's it. Let's. Uh, we have some um, some gr- a great show planned for everyone. So I hope uh, we get some calls here and ch- people are checking us out on Facebook. Our Facebook page has blown up. The TMI show with Justin Berkey on Facebook. We added a hundred and plus likes in a week and a half. Yeah, it's keep amazing. them coming. So you can always go in there, like us, and suggest what you want to hear, what you like, what you don't like. If you if you think we suck, you know, let us know, but be constructive about yeah, it. Yeah, give us a reason why we suck. Reason. Don't just be like, you guys suck. <laughs> Wow, yeah. wait, really original. I mean, be specific, because, you know, we could either take your suggestion or say, you know, the, the hell with you. We're, we're doing yeah. the show that we want to do. So. We like it, good, bad, or ugly, man. Just <laughs> say what you want to say and be well, honest with us. Ro, do we have some good music planned? I think you yeah, are I can, mixing I, it up for us. What yeah, do we got? I got some old school stuff coming up and look, some new things. So. Yeah. Yeah, we can get them in there. Let's do it. Throw some music on. Let's rock. Let's hip hop. Let's shake our bootays. And. This hump day is happening right now. It's the TMI show on WSCT.